first three interviews with Tian, Hannah, and Eloise. I have never once met anybody with my disorder before. It's been on my bucket list for years. And I'm, I'm nervous, I'm excited, and I'm ready. So let's, let's go. Have you ever met anybody with Fraser syndrome? No. Never? No. Now you can't say that. Um, no, no, yes, no, <laughs> no. <laughs> How is your body affected by Fraser syndrome? Um, like one kidney for instance. Uh, one kidney. Yeah. Um, play my eyes. My toes as well. Your toes are what? Um, they've got a webbing on yeah. these two. Sie hat nur ein Auge. Wir wissen noch nicht so hundertprozentig, wie gut sie hören kann. Sie hat nur eine Niere. It affected my right eye. Mm -hmm. I can show it. You guys so we'll talk uh, about the first ears. film, Fraser Syndrome yeah. and Me, documentary about a person with this rare disease, seeking other people who have the same rare disease. Uh, I saw this movie a couple times, it brought a tear to my eye the second time. What did you guys think about this film? Just what an amazing role model that young woman is. Because a lot of those people that have dealt with this and they have children, there's such a, a few in the world, it's crazy. But that she brought it all together for them to meet and support each other is phenomenal. I just think that was the greatest thing. It was so empowering. Even her mood and her, her outlook on life is so much better than people who don't have anything to deal with physically or, or with any kind of uh, thing like that. We should all really be counting our blessings. <laughs> yeah? yeah? I mean, she did an amazing, it was great. It was a very real film. It was almost like a documentary about a documentary. It was like, a, there was, it was kind of fun to watch. It was very raw, but in a very, like, good way. This film shows the struggle of people who are born with certain problems. Their struggle, struggle of their family, parents and how they unite and uh, pain stays up to the end but they somehow learn to cope with it and that's the positive part because uh, challenge comes for everyone these are just people who are born with challenge but otherwise every normal people also are born with they, they get challenges they lose eyes they lose hands they lose Anything could, have, could happen to anyone who is driving on the highway. So, <clears throat> I mean, danger is everywhere in that sense, okay? So, basically it shows that whatever happens to you, physically or mentally, if you can cope with that, and you can help others around you, then you will be winner. I think that's the message. That filmmaking is power. And filmmaking is acceptance in the community. The way she was talking about her parents, too, her dad, it was like kind of funny where like he's just kind of missing work and he kind of lives in this world and he just, his, the way his eyes opened up about how he got to connect with these, these parents about like living through their lives. Like, like this is the first comment, like she brought all, all those people together with her with this little documentary and we got, to, we, got to, we got to watch it as well from different places of the country, different ages, like uh, like from the two months year old, it was it was very fascinating. What I appreciated is the celebration. It definitely had a, a voice of celebration and gratitude, and that was really uh, heartwarming for me is to hear that. I think this film will be one of those that help more, help more people more, yeah, help people more than they really initially expect to, just because I know that'd be really hard to, to grow up with. It'd be really hard. So it'd be really, it's really good for it to have the expansion and showing that you can get through that as a family and a person individual. Well, I was so moved by this film, and there are um, visible and invisible um, disabilities or w th things that we, you know, we all have, we all share to one degree, degree or another, but I, I feel that uh, if only we could all show a little more support to just each person we, we meet, and just such as this film inspired, me to do reminds me. They say if, it, if you just get to know anybody, you're gonna like you're gonna like them, and, and you're not gonna judge them from afar and whatever. And they talk about like them staring at someone looking different and like how it made them feel and stuff. It yeah, it really puts things in perspective. Speaking um, of, I thought she had a really good comedic voice. Um, it reminded me a lot of the idea of certain stand-up comedy of not necessarily self-deprecation, but seeing funny in certain situations. So um, would commend her on that. It's hard to do. It's one, of the, it's one of those things where, like, the more you watched her, the more you saw her, she just was normal. At the beginning, she was like, oh, you can see 
she, she was different from the average person. But then the more you just watched her, the, she was just a normal person because you connected with her on a different level and the physical kind of just goes away after a while. That's just what I felt. I felt that that was kind of powerful in a lot of ways. Uh, let's go to the